Um, today I'm going to show you how to tether your Windows mobile phone. Mine is an HTC Touch Pro. How to tether it to a PlayStation 3. Now normally people would use the internet sharing program but I've been having some problems with that. Um, problems um, sharing my internet from my computer using the internet share internet sharing with my phone. So I've found a, another smartphone application that works I think even better. Uh, you can find it here at this website and download a trial version um, and on this website they'll let you download an XE, exe file or a cab file and I basically opened up this website on my phone and just downloaded it inside here and opened it in here. After you install the file, um, restart your phone, and then go back to settings. Let me set this up. And you should find it in. Did I screw that up? I think I did. Connections. And it'll be right. That's actually not it. Sorry about that. Oh, sorry. It's actually in programs. You'll find it in programs. Sorry about that. I see it. There it is. I'm going to go ahead and start, start this up. Notice I don't have anything connected to my phone at the moment. It's not connected to the computer yet. That's the way I like it. And what this program is really cool, it has really two really good functions. Uh, this guy right here, the 3G with the cable, allows you to tether. But this other one next to it is really cool. It allows you to send a wireless, uh, a Wi-Fi signal from your phone and uh, can connect any mobile laptop, um, connect that to your internet from your phone. Now the problem with that is it wastes, it drains your battery really fast and I don't recommend it. So if you can tether, go ahead and do it that way. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and press the tether button. So now it has internet. It's just waiting for the USB connection. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Bear with me. There we go. Uh, waiting for connection. Connected. Let's see. And on your PC, which I hope you guys are using, I'll go to Network Sharing Center. Sorry, it's a slow computer. Thank you, fuck's sake. Okay. Here's my Touch Pro. And this is my PlayStation 3, but it reads it as an unidentified network. It's directly connected through an Ethernet cable. So I'm just waiting for that to show up as internet time, which it might take a while since uh, it's doing two things at once. It's connecting your HTC Pro to internet at the same time sharing with your PS3. Now, if you don't get this first, uh, if you don't get, if this isn't getting internet, go to your view status. Uh, you don't want to go to properties. 
Why does that come up? Okay. And you should, should see this little tab right here that says sharing. And I already have this checked, but you're going to want this one checked here. And this you're going to change uh, to LAN or whatever it is. I, I called mine's PS3, so it'll say LAN on yours or local area network. Okay? Boop, boop. And for some effing reason, I'm not getting internet. Or it's not showing here. Maybe if I go to the website. Oh, what do you know? There is internet. It's just being retarded. See how it's working? It's doing stuff. Now, my connection, my tethering correct connection to my laptop is pretty fast. And it should be pretty fast to your PS3. Once you have it, your uh, computer connected directly to your PS3 through a Ethernet cable, which mine is connected, you can see right here, it runs all the way to, let's see, let's see, so I'm going to try to do two things at once, here I have my menu, Go to network settings. Sorry if you can't see that. Internet connection settings. It's gonna say some mumbo jumbo. You're gonna wanna go to custom wired and auto detect and say yes, 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 yes. Blah blah blah. Do you want to test the connection? Say yes. Hopefully it works the first time around when you guys do it. This might take a minute or two, depending on, well, depending on where you're at, I guess. Well, I know it says failed, but for some reason mine is a little weird. It'll even though it says failed, it will just sign me in for some reason. But the first time I did it it didn't say failed, it said connection succeeded, blah blah blah. Look at that thing. It's thinking. See? Check that out. Playstations are stupid. They don't know what the hell they're talking about. I'm connected. Even though it said failed connection, I'm still connected. So, I don't know what that means, but I don't really care. I can download anything I want now. Uh, just to show you how fast this connection is, I'm going to download a demo. Something I haven't downloaded yet. Which I hope you guys download the fuck out of this shit. Uh, let's see, anything small. Eh, Peggle, I guess. I don't want Peggle, but I'll just download it. 103 megabytes, that's... With my connection... Yeah, let's see. 12 minutes with my connection. It'll get a net uh, so... If you go to, if you, you can also check your internet connection uh, on your laptop, go to speed t speedtest.net and you should be able to see how fast your internet is from there. If, or not, I don't care. Do whatever you want. And that's it. That's my tethering with my HTC Touch Pro um, using using the software I found on this website called global.wmwifirouter.com and download the trial version 
Hopefully, if you're happy with it, purchase it. And again, I'm only downloading this application because internet sharing application was not working for me when trying to internet share my internet with my PS3. It were internet sharing works fine with my laptop, just not with the PS3. So there you go. Have fun and good luck.